Hey guys, hey supporters. All right, so this is a special video that I decided to do for a good supporter and friend of mine, Victoria's channel. You had requested to demonstrate a few techniques on how to improve your pole bending. So right here, I'm gonna show you a couple methods, techniques that I practice with my horses. They seem to help me into becoming better in communicating with leg cues and also helping to train your horse to start to pick up the correct leads, transforming into flying lead changes. Because that is what pole bending is all about. They do flying lead changes as you weave through. So here you're noticing I am applying a lot of leg pressure. Another thing here I do is I stop in between the cones and I sidestep. I stop, go forward, and I repeat the same thing. Sidestep over. Now the reason why I'm doing this is because this is helping my horse feel my leg cues. And she is learning where she needs to place her legs as well. So you want to do this a few times, you know, it is, it could be a little challenging. And then, you know, after you've done it on the, at the walk, try to pick it up to a faster pace. Now here I am trotting and you could see how she's weaving in nice and smoothly. So just think sidestep over forward, sidestep over forward. Okay, so this is just something that I like to practice with my horses. That way they don't get too hot just working around barrels. You know, get creative. Like I always tell you, get creative. Make your own drills. Just go out there and have fun. Your goal is to make sure you and your horse become a team together and your horse is a willing partner. So here I'm applying a lot of leg cues and I apply my leg pressure right when I'm in between the cones. So it's all about timing too. Well, I hope this little video has given you a little food for thought. Go out there and have some fun. Let me know how it goes.